What's up everyone and welcome back for some more Pokemon Z Dynamic Run Randomized Nuzlocke Last episode we, you thought we lost the Nuzlocke didn't you? But I mean we did lose the Nuzlocke technically but I made a comeback to this game because I love this game and I couldn't rest until we take down the swag boy himself that is Jake So I have assembled a new team which you can see from the sidebar I'll be showing off We got Link, Rock, Metroid 15 and Roxy, yeah, this is a new team, so let me show, so Link, here we have, he's our starter Pokemon, which in the escape route we got him, then we got Rock, who I encountered in Route 3 or 2, then I got Metroid in the Cave of Wonders, yeah, then I got 15 at Route 3 or 1, Roxy at 3 or 4, and that's all, but um, you might think, uh, there's no death, I mean, there is one death off screen since I did this whole thing off screen, um, I couldn't actually record this because I didn't have my time, but sadly one Pokemon had to die and it was none other than lucky one. It is a Finneon. I caught it on fire and trained that much, so not the worst I guess. So uh, I met him in the Niagara Bricks Forest at level 5. I couldn't train 111 to him and he died. Pretty sad, I understand. And also I couldn't catch two Pokemon. One Pokemon being Abra in the Cave of Wonders. Not the static encounter, the normal encounter. Uh, he used teleport and he ran off. Then I ran into Articuno in uh, Route 3 or 3 and in freaking legendary, so it's impossible to catch it. And I ran off. So with our new team, I think I like the, I like the side buff on this uh, team alone because I like. Look at Metroid, it's freaking like, oh god, I'm gonna destroy the world. Yeah, so I think this time we can at least uh, beat Jake because last time, the first attempt in this game. We lost to Jake, who if you guys don't know, he's a rival in this game. So we lost that guy, the swag boy. How did we lose to him? I don't know. So today we'll be exploring the routes. As I said, I already ran the Pokemon here, which is Articuno. And it ran off, so I couldn't catch it. So without any further ado, let's take on the episode. Yeah! Wow. Cacton, huh? Also, Link is freaking level 21. Freaking overpowered. So I'm going to actually switch the Pokemon. I think I'm going to put Metroid up in front Even though we have a water type what, uh, Metroid is water and poison so that's cool So let's check out this guy My partner doesn't always follow me It's quite, uh, it's quite annoying Cool bruh So let me give you guys a small story how I did this Nuzlocke It was actually pretty awesome Okay let, let, let me just say two things This guy has an Oshius and a freaking Vrizian God Starting the episode freaking a bang with a bang. Seriously, game? Why? I made a comeback to this game, and this is what you reward me with? Freaking Arceus, Arceus, and Virizion. Cool, bro. Magical leaf. I completely forgot that Virizion is a freaking water type. I mean, why didn't it hit Link? I don't know. Let's go to acid. Oh god, I'm kind of scared to take down um, Link at uh, the Magical Leaf, so... Uh, oh, wait, Magical Leaf, I don't attack one for day. Let's go for Oshius. God is going to just spam the Cautious. I mean, the Seismic Power or Cosmic Power, whatever the heck, I don't care. Oh my god, can, can Link survive? I knew it. Link is the best, yo. Yes, for now, uh, Metroid is doing pretty good damage with Acid. So, Razor Shell should do a ton. That did freaking nothing. Okay, let's switch to 15 because I know 15 has uh, sleep powder, it has stun powder and headbutt I think. So 15, the, the reason I named uh, uh, you know this guy, yeah, it is a guy, yeah. So I, why I uh, nicknamed uh, Jumpluff as 15 is a freaking big reason. Number one being uh, I caught since the uh, uh, Jumpluff is the first one I encountered in the 3.1, uh, I had 15 Pokeballs. And I caught uh, this guy in the 15th Pokemon. How lucky is that? Freaking so lucky. So I'm gonna heal up Metroid because I don't want Metroid to die. And I'm gonna go for the sleep uh, stun. Let's go for the sleep powder on Arceus because that guy is gonna be spamming the cosmic power and it'll be pretty hard to take him down. So Arceus has sleep. Yeah. We put the god to sleep. Yeah. Let's go for the acid again. And let's go for the headbutt, I guess. Apparently. If this acid doesn't take it down, headbutt should take it down. Did it really wake up so fast? Bruh! Bruh! Are you serious? 
good thing uh, metroid is actually half poison type because he can actually tank out those grass types yeah need a life for the comeback of this game also don't worry if you think this is the going to be the only series you're wrong because there'll be another series will be coming out i don't want to spoil it okay good thing this, this guy didn't have another legend book man i was actually waiting for him if will this guy have another legendary no there's no stun powder because it actually lasts forever and it does uh, slow down us yes for ugly oh god did you see the gavel shit oh my oh god no more dying please okay since uh, you know uh, virusian is dead i think i'm going to be switching back to link because you know link is the best also i nicknamed uh, you know the water slink because uh link you know is a swordsman he's the, he's the best combat the man so that's why what a serious god purgly you suck i know that's kind of rude but sorry ah uh, okay let's go for the razor shell also i accidentally kicked my bag and since the link is asleep i think i'll heal him up just just in case just in case let's heal a blink and with the power of 15 let's put this purgly to sleep that is if we can land the damn sleep powder gosh dang it this thing is doing pretty good gravity gravity bra that that's a pretty good movie i know that but gravity ah no ga okay okay no more uh, no more pokemon logic when will link freaking wake up gosh do we have like i don't have another awakening do i So um head but the ash yes you know head but in the guard that's the, oh god 15 what the heck did you guys see the damn and that ash yes we also flinched ash yes what the heck i mean lucky in this game for once oh my god can you take the ash yes never mind pura ugly works wakes up and goes for growl of all the moves you could go you're going for growl cool bra link go for the razor shell on pura ugly though a punishment shed Okay, I thought I'll do a freaking ton of damage, but didn't do that much. I go with the headbutt on oh, no, Ashes. Come on, Ashes! I know you're the god. You know, this guy should give us freaking some billion zillion EXP, yeah, right? Forty, forty-six, twenty-six, thirty-three. Maybe the god is really not the god. Did you guys see the beautiful EXP he gave us? Yeah, I know that. So uh, the only threat now is Purakli. So. Let's take now the swift razor shell. Wow, the first battle. Just remember, this is the first battle. So that's cool. 15 gets some EXP and he learns goes to level 18. Uh, Pokemon Rangers Chris and Chris both are the same name, but she can battle from a distance. Cool, bra. Okay, my dad. That bird catcher is still left. Uh, And both are getting pretty stronger, so I think I'll put Metroid for now. Oh my God! It's a Soul Rock. I mean, I always wondered Soul Rock should have been what? I mean, Fire and Rock, but uh, I don't know. It's Rock and Psychic for some reason. Yeah, buddy, buddy. Yeah, buddy, buddy. Bruh, I'm not gonna say anything. Bird Keeper Samuel. Uh, I don't know. Thank you. This is gonna give a chunk of EXP. Free EXP, of course. I go for Acid. Okay, this is only attacking. What the heck? Audinos can attack. I thought they are used for getting free EXP. Metro, I know. Oh God. Okay, okay, okay. Control. Let's go for. Let's go back to Link. Cause Link and 15 are the the old the old powers, the old G's, the OG's. So Link and 15 are pretty overpowered, are over leveled, and they're pretty strong. So let's go for the shell, a swift razor shell. And Arduinos can. I, I actually didn't know that Arduinos can attack. That they, I thought they were like, uh, you know, freaking free EXP, but uh, they can attack. Let's try with the freaking crap ton of EXP. Wants to learn Toxic Spikes. Not bad actually. Let's get rid of some. Uh, let's get rid of Constrict. You know that's that's not the best move. Let's get rid of Constrict. We learn Toxic Spikes and Link gets a nice EXP. So next comes Murkrow. Uh, I mean, no one no, of no, my team can do that much good, so I think I'll go stick with Link for now. And this Murkrow is apparently flying. I don't know why. You're feeling shy. Wing attack though. 
I thought it'll do a ton of damage, but not that much. And in this game, we have a start to live. Yeah, live a life for that. So next, blaze again. Wow. I'm actually kind of scared, but you know what? I think I should should take down Blaze again with one shot. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, bro. Link, you are the best. Even though you're a girl, I think Link fits you. The the name. So bird keepers, I'm you. You're not the bird. Yeah, that's what I, I was trying to say the whole time. So let's go heal up. Let's go to the Pokemon Center and heal up. Oh, sorry, the comment is kind of uh, choppy, I guess. Because my voice is kind of uh, dead, almost. Not that dead, but it is dead, okay? So let's go back to the Pokemon Center, but of course, no battle is... Oh, Zigzagoon. That's so cute. I always thought Zigzag was the ugly Pokemon until X and Y because of the sprite. Then this sprite looks so cute and also from the anime. Anime Zigzag was the cutest the little... Uh, what is Zigzag? Is it like a raccoon? I mean it should be a raccoon because of Zigzagoon. Like Zigzag Raccoon. Yeah, make some sense. And the game, you know, the best. I don't know why it happened. Why did to me but the game doesn't respond. So thank you Razai for healing. We used a Pokemon to 3 XP. Hope you visit again. Okay. Whoa, did that? Something happened to the game. I thought the game became choppy. So actually let's buy some healing items because we are part of it need it. So let's buy one more uh, hyper potion and one great ball because you can catch one more Pokemon in one cave, I think. I don't remember. I think it's a midnight way. So we can catch a Pokemon there, so we can get a full slot of Pokemon. And I hope it doesn't be, hope it doesn't be legendary, po legendary Pokemon. Gosh, I can't talk. Ah! Hopefully the, our encounter doesn't be legendary Pokemon because they are hard to catch. And for real. So let's go back towards the Birdman. Birdman. Is there a superhero Birdman? I mean, I have heard of Superman, Batman, Spider-Man. Is, th is there a guy known as Birdman? I don't think so. Ah... Uh, Whoa, Rapalos though. That's totally which I see every day, you know. They're not rare. I mean, just kidding, they're freaking rare. So, yeah, we made it to this road. And I think up ahead is the Midnight Way, where this girl is there to talk to her. I will predict you. I predict you will not lose this battle. I hopefully I don't lose the battle. So, Psychic Gear, yeah, with your touch, kiss. Oh, that's so cute! I think a Metroid can take care of this one. Let's go with the acid. And that did like no damage. Aura Spear, bruh. Told you guys has Aura Spear so early on. Is that even fair? Ass Slash? What the heck? This Tolik is freaking overpowered. Link, I need your help. Come on, bro. Do it, Link. You're the best watchman ever. Don't die. Okay. Let's go for the Razor Shell. Extreme speed, what the heck? This Tozik is freaking overpowered. Not gonna lie. Also this thing has extreme speed. So not even gonna risk it. Let's let's heal up Link. Link! You are you know the I mean there are two meanings for Link. Link being like the you know the chain of link or links of chain something. Oh you're faster than Tozik is. Cool! Bye bye Tozik is that's cute. Let's try with freaking crap and of EXP. Link with some craft on VXP. We have defeated Psychic Gala. Damn, could it be? I was wrong. Oh no, you were right actually because you told I would not lose, but I actually won, so that's cool. So we got here a super person. Yeah, so since we can catch Pokemon in the upcoming cave, I think I'll be putting 15 up in front because he has sleep powder, stun spore, and all sorts of status elements. So it's happy traveling with silver, yeah. I also named my my character as silver, I forgot to mention it, so let's go inside the midnight way. Hopefully you can catch a Pokemon here, not a legendary, because they're freaking hard to catch. So the first Pokemon in the midnight way is gonna be a... Uh... Wow, it's a bay leaf! Not bad actually because this is our second starter, so not bad. Let's go for the sleep powder. This should uh, increase our catch rate by I don't know how much. So let's suck them great ball. I have got 11 of them, so I feel pretty confident catching this bay leaf. So throw them ball. 
Ah, oh, yes! Wow! You're so lucky! Gotcha! Bayleaf was caught! How does Loki next? Bayleaf, the leaf Pokemon! Oh, uh, Bayleaf's neck is ringed up by curling leaves. Inside each leaf is a small tree shot. The fragrance of the shot makes people... Peppy? Okay, Peppy. So, I'm going to name you... Peppy, I guess. So, that's cool. Welcome to the team, Peppy. Good to have you on. I also realized we have got a full team in this game for finally because the last tournament we didn't get a full team and the last last tournament we didn't get a full team but finally this time we have got a full team of six with Peppy also it's a male so that that name doesn't feel so good so careful nature that's pretty good we have got tackle growl razor leaf and poison powder so we have two water types two grass types one rock steel type and one poison type. I mean two poison types because of Metroid is part water part uh, poison that's good. Cool. So up ahead we'll be having our final battle against not final battle the battle to end it. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Montres, you yeah, bro! Haven't seen you since Jodo. So let's go heal up and let's take this guy on. Booyah! Welcome back guys, we are pretty good to go, we, I have healed up, so I think we are pretty good to go, so Gosh dang it, why do I run into white pokemons? What the heck, Sharpedo? Oh, I just dreamt of having a Sharpedo, or also riding a Sharpedo, freaking awesome You know, Mega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, you can actually ride on Sharpedo It also has a custom sprite, it looks pretty awesome, so Only if I could play this game, or those games So I'm going to put Peppy up in front uh, instead of Rock, you know, Rock isn't doing that great. Uh, no, I should actually put uh, uh, Peppy up in front because we need the max P. So Peppy, are you good? Still undecided whether travel with like, silver is good or bad. Bro is good, okay? Winter is coming. That's it. That's it. Winter is coming. Yanks is a bastion. With freaking Deoxys again. Ah! Good thing we have Link. Yeah, leave a like, cause Link is freaking level 22 And you can tank down water, this guy is going for Nightshade bruh Really Nightshade? Haha, <laughs> jokes on you bro I have Razor Shell Bye bye Deoxys? More like uh, uh, nothing Haha <laughs> Peppy with 500 EXP, wow Gonna get them levels Wants to learn Synthesis Um, Why not? Let's get rid of Growl that's not doing the best and synthesis can heal us up if we run out of potions or something so link with the exp to level 23 cool so next we're gonna send out hophead even though hophead is a grass type i think we're pretty good because we got fury cutter booyah P gosh i why i don't like this i think there's actually petcha berry there near us so not bad let's go for Metroid! Yeah, Metroid rules! That, that's the best game. I highly recommend you guys check it out. We, have, we play as Samus. And if you guys don't know Samus is a girl, pretty shocking, right? I didn't know that. Samus is a girl. I thought he's a freaking you awesome guy with, uh, I don't know, armor or something. So Silver got that special piece and I think, I think we have uh, some kind of potion, baby thing. Yes! Are you serious? We don't have Pekka Berries? Oh god, I think I have my... But yes! We got three Pekka Berries! Thank god! Good thing I had Pekka Berries in my inventory. They came pretty handy. So, up ahead is the battle against the swag. So I think I'll put a Metroid up in front maybe? You know what? No. I think I'm going to open up with Link because I don't lose this battle so bad. So I'm going to put Link up in front and get some own Berries because they heat us up. Yeah! So we put the two enemies in the back. So without any further ado, let's take on our final challenge. Are, are you serious, bro? I'm giving a serious, in, uh, giving a serious commentary, and this happens. I'm in a trick. So without any further ado, let's take on the swag boy himself. Well, well, well. Want to guess who has already got two badges? You have two guesses. The first one doesn't count. That's right, me! Maybe I'll make a gym! These gyms are awful anyways! I could live in a mansion and hand the swag badge every day! 
What am I doing? You and me, let's go! So the final battle against Jake, who is the rival the swag boy himself. So the revenge of the swag goes. He has super dodge to go. He's gonna open up with Hitmon Lee. I'm gonna set a link up in front. And let's go with the Razor Shell. And that's it. Are you serious? That's all. Next comes Persian. I don't care. I got Link. Grab Link. Haha, <laughs> this battle is over. Yeah, with one Razor Shell or two. Because Persian level 16, really? That's pretty lot. Whoa, almost killed. Let's go with the Water Gun. See you later, Persian. Even though you're cool, I'm gonna take it down. Okay. If the Fury Swipes would have landed five times, we would have been dead. Honestly, so Link got 500 XP and we got our revenge against the Swag Boy. No! My Swag! Yeah, cry. Dang, my Swag ruined? Just pass, I have enough of you anyways. We have finally beat, we have beat the Swag Boy and we made ourselves to own Nega Town. Dickletine, Dickletine, Trio, Trio, Trio. Yeah, finally, we have made some progress in this game. If you guys don't know, for the last episode, we have been playing the tired old parts again and again. But finally, we have some new content to begin. So, stay tuned for more episodes of Pokemon Zeta Nomic Run Randomized Nuzlocke. But before end of the episode, there's actually the Safari Zone to check it out. So, without any further ado, I mean, um, should we go inside or not? I mean, I don't know the rules of Nuzlocke for the Safari Zone. So, let's go anyway. Hi, Trey, this is Safari Zone. Just for 500 dollars you can cruise the wild brassic regions of Brisbane region, huh? What is that? Yeah! Let me find it, please. You don't need special kind of buggy balls here. We got 30 Safari balls from the internet. We'll call you on PA when you time to run out of buggy balls. You can throw rocks at that Pokemon to lower their health. We will wish you best of luck. I don't know why I gave him like a creepy old accent, so... The first Pokemon in this world we can catch, but I don't know how the rules are uh, actually come here in the Safari Zone because there are ton of, uh, tons of different areas and we can only use Safari Balls, which is kind of cheap actually because they could run away. That would suck, so uh, let's actually go to uh, the best spot ever, which is over here. So let's go talk to this guy. Keep your eyes peeled for rat Pokemon. This Pokemon in this zone, you can't find them anywhere else. So the first Pokemon in the Safari Zone is going to be a... Uh, it's going to be a... Uh, Whoa! Kingler! That's sick! We're going to actually have Mrs. Krabs come alive! Oh, let's go for it! Let's toss the Safari Ball! Can we catch this Kingler? Never mind! No! Kingler, why did you flee? And that's all, we can't catch any more Pokemon here. That's sad. Pretty sad. I actually wanted to catch Pokemon in the Safari Zone, but what the fudge? Freaking Palkia, what the heck, no! <sighs> Palkia, the ruler of time, apparently came to Safari Zone. Uh, I mean, ruler of space, I think, because Dialga is the ruler of time, Palkia is the ruler of space. So that's cool, so the next episode. We will be going exploring on Nega Town, probably taking on the gym. And oh, is that a PG art? That's cool. So in the next episode, we will be taking on the gym probably and doing some side stuffs. And Team Olympus is here, so I don't know. So stay tuned for more episodes. As always, see you in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.